Good morning, world. It's a Sunday. Oh, perfect. Sunday reset. Should I wear pink shorts? I have a lot to do in the way of cleaning today, unfortunately. Frog fuel. 15 grams of protein. Link in bio. Okay, pre-workout. Here's my purse. Okay, good to have. So potent. Y'all can't tell, but my legs are literally fuzzy wuzzy was a bear. But I don't care. I'm like, if you're looking at my legs, you're too close. Back up. I am officially moving in slow-mo. I finished my workout and then I just sat in my car outside of my place for like mm, 40 minutes. And now I'm in here and I don't know what to do. <laughs> I need to shower because I'm gross. Oh my gosh. My flowers totally perked up. I got these from Nanny's Garden yesterday. I'll go... Take a body shower real quick. Come downstairs, make coffee and breakfast. Maybe start a load of laundry while I'm upstairs. Really, upstairs is what I need to tackle. Like, I've kept down here pretty clean. Okay, I gotta turn the heat on. I'm caving. It's so cold in here. It is 69 degrees. That's... We'll do 71. I would like it to be 700. Ooh, and I made pumpkin muffins, so I'll have one of those with my breakfast too. These cutie pink biker shorts, Buff Bunny. I'll put my code below. They're just precious, everything about them. I don't know why I'm like, yeah, I like these biker shorts so much. <laughs> Sit still. I knew getting this shoe rack would be the worst idea for me because I would just leave all my shoes down here and sure enough, that's what I do. It's on my Amazon storefront though. <laughs> Everyone say hi to my plants, they're thriving. Here is the official situation. Wow. Wowie wow. Oh mercy, I've got to take that trash out. Ew, it's giving hoarders buried alive. All showered, I even shaved, Um, so let's light a candle. I got this at a little out, outside market. I don't know what my best friend, Dax. Shout out Dax, love you king. Creamy nutmeg, it smells like fall. I'm gonna go get some lotion, we'll lather up, get dressed, start the day. I've been using this one by Isle of Paradise. It reminds me of some candy, honestly. And she's thick. Mm -mm -mm. Lotion after every shower, ladies, come on. I'm going for a clean girl aesthetic today. I just did lotion, little under eye concealer, eyebrows, kept my hair sweaty, put more oil in it, slicked it back. Let's make some coffee. Best part of the day, honestly. Y'all know I love my Nespresso. I also got these off of Amazon. The pods already have like a aluminum seal on the top. And this is a new one so that I can refill the pod with my own stuff and then seal it back up and use it again. Does that make sense? So I'll let y'all know how these work. For now, I'm just gonna go with the regular. Regular moment. Oh, that doesn't sound too good. Putting in some oat milk. Actually, oh, okay, perf. Still rocking the pumpkin spice from Aldi. I actually need to make a trip to Aldi soon. Mm-mm. Delicioso. I'm just gonna do a muff for breakfast. Guys, look at this. These are pumpkin streusel muffins. I made them on my TikTok, so the recipe's there, but oh my gosh, they're so good. They turned out absolutely perfect. Nice fall treat. Perfect combo. Current living room situation, not bad. I'm gonna grab this laundry off the floor. I literally stripped the second I came home <laughs> because I was babysitting and they have cats and dogs and I know there's hair all over this. Not getting on my couch with this, so. Add to the pile. Ooh, I forgot I had that candle burning, yikes. Okay, I'm gonna attempt to put all this in here. If you don't let your bathroom garbage overflow, then you're lying. <sighs> Mission accomplished. This mostly consists of Dr. Dennis Gross peel pads and pimple patches. I sleep with my do not disturb on and this spam call number had the actual nerve to call me twice to bypass my do not disturb. Don't make me do something drastic, okay? That's crazy. That's rude. First off, that's rude. First, let's collect everything from off of the floor. Plus everything in here. I'm gonna wait to start a load of laundry and just wash my sheets so I can get that done. Three, two, one. Just gonna step over all this. Oh, actually, I can wash my white towels. I still haven't bought a replacement container, so. Sprinkles. 
I'm like actually breaking a sweat right now. My computer is somewhere. And I brought my charger up so I can charge it because it's dead. Um, and watch some TV. Oh wait, no, she's alive, 10%. Actually, I was gonna watch Breaking Bad because I've been watching it on my phone on Netflix, but I can't get into my Netflix on my computer or my TV, only on my phone because of these new rules, which I'm not happy about, I'll have you know, but apparently you can still watch it on your phone because it's harder or they can't trace the IP address. I don't know, that's what the Geek Squad said, okay? Oh my gosh, all in a day's work, right? Yo, best day of my life. I got into Netflix on my computer. Thank you, not only God, but Jesus. I just collected all these from the railing, so let's fold them. Now this pile of clothes goes in there. Sheets are done, let's switch. Whoa, oh my gosh. Oh, gotta clean that. This mini trash can is my favorite thing ever. Put all my lint in there and call it a day. Now let's start another load. One of these sprinkles. Thanks. Obviously I have a bunch of boxes to take care of. And these three things, I'm covering my address. I need to open them. Time for our second, well, it's not a, I didn't have, really have a meal. I'm eating, I'm hungry, okay? <laughs> and it's gonna be breakfast, because that's my favorite type of food. So, two hash browns in the air fryer. I wonder if this avocado, no, literally hard as a rock. Two of these. I did two pieces of turkey bacon, two hash browns. I have one of the eggs already on there. You know I use my little egg maker, you know I did. We're gonna scoop the second one on and I just put a little Parmesan on top after it came out of the microwave so it got all melty. And yeah, there we go. What a fire, what time is it? It's like two o'clock lunch, I don't know. Um, I'm gonna do a little ketchup. Follow it up with some hot sauce. Guys, this is just like such an ideal meal for me. I love breakfast so much. And these crispy A hash browns. Should we do a taste test? Oh my gosh, listen. That crunch. Nothing like it. You done? I'm gonna watch Breaking Bad and devour this. True life, you live in a loft. Okay, I just went upstairs, you know, y'all know I'm doing laundry, got the dryer running, all that. Okay, I also did have the heat on, but whatever, all right? It was like 71, that's not crazy. I'm downstairs right now, I'm frigid. My leg hair is growing back at a rapid pace right now. Upstairs, a steam room. <laughs> like, I'm not, I would rather be upstairs right now because it's freaking warm but every single surface is foggy. Actually, that reminds me, I need to clean all my mirrors because now that it's all foggy, I can see all the smudges and marks and stuff. Where the wind takes eight. But like, I had to turn on the AC, Avi, to try and cool down the upstairs. Oh wait, I have microfiber towels. Chris would be so proud that I'm actually <laughs> thinking, <laughs> using my brain, right? Because those would be better on a mirror. Here's one, I, I stole this one from him because it's pink. So obviously I need that, he doesn't need that. Okay, this orange one. Okay, great, let's go clean the mirrors. I'm having such a cute and cozy day. It's like super gloomy outside. I don't know if I told you guys that. And it's also freezing. We've hit the heat wave. Like look, even this mirror is foggy. It's much better now because I turned on this fan. I also have little circle marks from my phone case on all of my mirrors too, so. They really all need to be cleaned. We're at the car wash. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. <laughs> Watch me get copyrighted <laughs> because I'm just so similar. Putting this up was the best idea. I don't know where I would be storing all of my stuff if it wasn't in here. I mean, like, she is packed to the brim. Not even gonna bother with that. <laughs> Just kidding, I wouldn't even try. Um, however, my landlord is having someone come clean that window, I think beginning of November. She's super particular about anyone she hires to do anything 
on any of the properties she owns, which is great. I'm happy about that. So she was like, it's taking me forever to find like a reliable, well-recommended person. I was like, girl, take your time, queen. I care and I appreciate. Let's go ahead and open up these. We'll go easy first. Okay, <laughs> it's not that easy. Pimple patches. I use these every night and I put them even just on like the tiniest little bumps, any texture, anything. It just sucks everything right out. These are amazing. They're 72 in a pack and they're usually like eight or nine dollars on my storefront. <gasps> this is so exciting. I realized that I was starting to get like a lot of clogged pores specifically after I worked out. I would notice just like tiny little poppable like clogged pores. Anyways, this is a facial mist and it's antibacterial. It basically just kills all the bacteria on your face. Invisible on skin, no flaky residue. Bacteria is the leading cause of blemishes. Cleanse away without drying your skin. I think this is genius. It smells like, not cleaning product. <laughs> like hydrogen peroxide maybe? Does hydrogen peroxide even smell though? Mmm, a nice glow. Thanks. Last packet. Merit Beauty. Minimalist Beauty. Three products. See what we got. Ow. See what we got. Ooh, Great Skin Instant Glow Serum. The Minimalist Perfecting Complexion Stick. And the Blending Brush. Let's just get into them right now, shall we? Ooh, now this is nice. It has 2% niacinamide, four types of hyaluronic acid, caffeine-rich cacao seed extract, Japanese gold thread root, and pH, and it's pH balanced. So plumping, hydration, brightening, soothing, healthy skin barrier. So luxurious, thanks. I tried to pick a lighter color because I want to use it like on my face as, you know, more of a, like a highlight. I don't want it to be the exact color of my skin. So let's see how I did. Okay, that looks a little tan, honestly right so creamy cannot wait to use every single one of these products and feel like i'm rich i've had this little ball in my purse for like a week it's the top to my lamp what is this called it's called the i don't know whatever i keep forgetting to put it on so i'm gonna finally do it wow amazing <laughs> Sheets are done. Now these go in the dryer. Actually, a lot of this is gonna get hung up. Here's the sheets. I'm just gonna save y'all the pain and suffering that I'm about to endure. And just do a cute little transition once it's all made. I hate putting sheets on the bed, okay. Three, two, one. Oh yeah, perfect. Also obsessed with my lamp. I don't know if I told you guys, but I told you on TikTok. I got this at Home Goods and I put the one that used to be here downstairs on my desk. I just need to cut the freaking <laughs> the tags off of it. Let's do that now. The most girl thing ever. I'm using like cuticle cutters or something. Also, I have my wallpaper on my Amazon storefront for you guys. I just I couldn't be more in love with it. It's so perfect. I never want to move because I never want to leave it. It's so good. And this um, carpet I got at an antique store. It's actually a real cowhide and it's like laser cut. So it has all these metallic silver spots in it. I got it in Richmond. And then this um, crushed velvet, it's actually pink, but there's not much light right now. I got this from Amazon too. It's just a duvet cover. These pillows are Target. This is no clue this picture frame is home goods this i got from an antique store a little glass vase or whatever and then my whole bed set like this side table my bed frame and headboard and this is from rooms to go a couple years ago honestly i think i'm about to lay on my couch and just read my book for a minute i usually read it when i'm going to bed i never read during the day i thought this would be like super crazy and random of me to do <laughs> okay i fully fell asleep <laughs> I read about one chapter and I was zonked. I only nap for like an hour since then. I've just been kind of on my phone. It's now time for dinner and we are gonna be doing what's called a work with what you have. So I have two things in mind, taquitos and salad. I bought this avocado Caesar. Someone in my TikTok comments, I made another salad. They were like, oh, you should have got the avocado Caesar. I was like, girl, I got that one too. 
Hopefully this one's better. The Asian Caesar was like meh. And I'm gonna use the rest. Oh, this is so sad. Why did I do this to myself? Is this two? Did I left myself two taquitos? I just think that was really rude of me. I wonder if I even, like, I don't even have, I have a tortilla, but I don't even think I have any cheese. I'm like, you don't make a quesadilla. I don't know. I don't want to spend money on food. That's my main goal every day is to spend like zero dollars on food. I hope the lettuce in this one is not bad because the Asian Caesar, I had to throw away like half of it. Oh yeah, this looks much better. I wonder if I have a tomato though. Some corn niblets and some tortilla strips. Some cheese. And this is the dressing. I'm just gonna trust that it's good. It looks, it looks like get out me swamp, but it is giving avocado and I love avocados. Mm. That is divine. Oh my gosh, this is my new favorite salad kit. Guys, this dressing is like a little limey, like a like a southwest avocado. Nanny gave me this tomato from her garden, but it might be bad. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. That doesn't look bad to me. That is yummy. Now we got a little color in there. Can't even see. Now we got a little color. <laughs> Ooh, taquito's done. I'm gonna add some ranch for dipping. Now this is a dinner of champion. I'm just gonna sit here and watch Breaking Bad and eat my dinner and drink my water. As I should. All right, I loaded, no, I unloaded and loaded my dishwasher. And now it's time to do hair, skin, teeth. I'm gonna start with teeth. I start with flossing. Then I'm gonna do oil pulling, which I just recently added back into my routine, AKA recently equals yesterday. <laughs> from, from my knowledge, what it does is even when you floss and you brush, there's still like pockets up in your gums that can harbor bacteria, extra food, little things, particles, whatever. Oil pulling pulls that out of those pockets. So it's like another layer deeper. Um, and this has a bunch of great stuff in it. Coconut oil, peppermint oil, spearmint, clove, tea tree, cardamom, oregano, fennel, vitamin E, vitamin D, vitamin K2. It's all natural ingredients. There's nothing that would be bad for you in this. So what I do is I floss, I do this. I try to swish it for 10, 15 minutes. It's a long time, but that's what they say. Even try to work up to 20 minutes. I don't know if anyone has time for that. And then I brush my teeth and then I do <laughs> mouthwash. I won't bore you guys with that part. All these products are on my storefront if you're interested in any of them. And this is the toothpaste that I use. The Crest, no, Colgate Optic White. I'm gonna get those done and then we can do skincare together. Oh, I also forgot to say that I water pick too. I'm charging it right now, but I water pick after I've lost because I have a permanent retainer. Stuff can get caught in there too. And then when you go to the dentist, they have to scrape it off and I hate it. So I just water pick at home. So it makes it a little easier. Sorry for the eerie music. Okay, teeth are done and I already washed my face. I use this Skin Fix. BHA cleanser and I use one of these scrubbies. I used to use these religiously. I was off them and I thought the other day I was like, I'm probably not cleaning my skin well enough with my hands. It's like using a loofah in, in the shower. Like you have to use a loofah to really clean your body. Same thing with these. They're just silicone. They come in packs of like three and four and stuff on Amazon. So that's what I do for the face. And then I just keep it super simple. Even this started like clogging my pores a little bit the other day i was like why am i getting these and i i just had to stop like moisturizers it's so hard for me to find a moisturizer that doesn't end up clogging my pores these still my og still so good i think i already mentioned that i got the pack that is or did i put that in my tiktok i was using the extra strength version and i went back down to the normal strength version because i think the extra strength was too harsh on my skin and was honestly causing me to break out or could have been a part of it. I don't know, I'm not a scientist, okay? Like, it really is trial and error. Like, when my skin starts to break out, I have to, like, start taking out certain things, seeing if it gets better, taking out other things, seeing if that gets better. <laughs> Dermatologists are quaking listening to me explain this. <laughs> but I'm actually really excited, okay? Tomorrow, so my mom's um, good friend, bestie, whatever, one of her core people, um, owns a med spa. And so I'm gonna go there tomorrow 
and see how I can help them with their social media and um, see how I can help just kind of promote them. They're also doing a ladies night as they call it. I don't know how often they do them, um, but it's where they do crazy deals on filler and Botox and all that. So this coming Friday, today is October 15th. Um, this coming Friday, they're having a ladies night and that means that Botox is $8.50 a unit. That is so cheap. Um, typically, I pay $10 a unit um, in DC, but I think it's normally like $13. She gives me a discounted price. Um, it depends on how big the city is, though, for the price, of course. Like, if you're in New York City, it's going to be expensive. If, if you're in Fargo, North Dakota, probably going to be $5 a unit. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, but it's going to be cheaper, okay? But $8.50 is cheap. And they were doing, I think, buy two, get one filler, like just crazy deals. So I'm going to go and kind of brainstorm with them. And then I have to wait two minutes after the first wipe to let it all dry. And then you go in with the second wipe. The first one is exfoliate and smooth. This one is the anti-aging neutralizer. So I'm going to the med spa tomorrow. And then I don't think I have any other plans. I don't know. I feel like I need to do more with my time. I want to look at some volunteer opportunities, see what I can... So I can do what I enjoy, like, maybe I would enjoy working at, like, a Goodwill or something. I don't know, maybe I wouldn't enjoy that. I would enjoy shopping at a Goodwill. <laughs> Let's be honest. Let's be really, really honest. Because I'm, I'm so good at just staying in my little bubble. I'm so comfy in my house. I'm so comfy doing my little routine, going to work out, come home, make breakfast, get on with my day. I didn't even leave my house today. I mean, it, it was a Sunday reset, okay? But... I didn't go anywhere, I didn't run any errands, I didn't see anyone, and I'm completely fine with that. But then sometimes my mom's like, Sophia, you're not like getting out there. And I'm like, you're right, I'm not. But also the world is a scary place, okay? All my friends and I are long distance. Like every single one of my people does not live in Atlanta. Now, okay, yeah, go make friends, but I don't, I don't like to go out and be social. I don't like to go out and drink. I don't, I don't know. Whatever, I'm not stressing because actually I am living my best life. I'm happy, you know, I wake up every day and I can't wait to live this day. I never wake up and I'm like, oh, when I would work on TV and be waking up at 2 a.m., I would be so dreading every single thing I had to do that day, dreading my next schedule change. I would dread each day and I don't feel like that at all anymore and I'm so happy and I'm so thankful and I'm so blessed because I... I haven't felt that anxiety in so long. I'm so used to being happy now. So I don't wanna make myself feel like I'm not doing enough. I just know that maybe I would feel like I am have more of a purpose. That's what it is. If I had obligations. You feel? You see? You see? I guess I'll get up and shower in the morning, wash it, and do my little braids. Look how oily it is, but it's gonna be so shiny. I hardly ever put heat on it and I just, don't wash it as much as I can. I did. I miss that. I always try to throw stuff in the trash can and miss every time. For the hair, we're going to do the hair growth oil. This is minoxidil and biotin. I get this on Amazon. And I just take this along the crown of my head, kind of like the edges. And then I take my fingers and just massage it into my scalp. October 20th is going to be my four-month hair update. I'm so excited to film that because I want to see the before and after pictures. But also I cut off three inches since the last time I did an update. It'll be cool to see how my hair benefited from that. Okay, I'm in my fresh, cozy, crispy, crunchy sheets. I love you guys. Thanks for spending the day with me as always. I had a great time. Even if we didn't leave the house, I still had a great day. And I didn't have to interact with anyone. <laughs> okay, I love you. Bye.